Yo, what's up guys? So today we have exactly what's on the title, an insanely lucky Yu-Gi-Oh! play that only 3% of the time will be actually working. What is that? Well, it's got a little bit of luck. This is probably one of the luckiest Yu-Gi-Oh! plays I think I've ever seen because the guy actually needed it. Anyway, so what it's going to revolve around is a uh, coin flip mechanic or dice roll over here with this deck over here facing off against uh, a really fan favorite archetype which is the king of skull servant archetype or skull servants anyways he's gonna go ahead and attack right into the misjudge unfortunately favorite box didn't work out for him that time we're gonna go ahead and see an extravagant test there's probably not gonna be any necessary need to go into the extract snipe hunter gonna go ahead and get lucky get a five so king of skull servants is gone duality is then activated he's gonna go ahead and get that effect of snipe hunter for one more time to go ahead and get rid of the lady in white and then he's going to go ahead and pass off to the next player's turn, which he's going to go ahead and activate the unexpected die. Go right into a Link Karibu so we can block another attack, potentially, because you want these cards in the graveyard. Going to go ahead and then have the King of Skulls from its attack. Okay, flip number one over here. Calls Tails, gets it right. That's number one. The second time over here, another 50% chance in a row. Getting it again. He's going to go ahead and activate the King of Skull of the Servants and summon itself again. Again, getting another copy of that. three times. Going to go for the fourth one over here he gets it again he's calling it right four times bro he's gonna go ahead and talk with Mizuki, and then again he calls it right and that's five heads in a row basically he otk'd himself and to kind of show you guys the math over here of why it would be this number over here he had 50 percent chance and then again you can also do it a different way you can type in the probability of flipping a coin five times and getting all heads which would just be uh it's three percent it's three uh three point like one two five percent but so basically it's a three percent chance for this to all go off super super rare but uh, yeah that's the math basically right there to get it all in a row to absolutely insane i just like stupid Yu-Gi-Oh videos like this and hopefully you guys do as well and if you did yo drop a like on it i know some of you guys might be wondering yo hook me up with the deck profile yo shout outs to uh the guy for hooking me up with this uh, his name was born to kill i um, mean i guess he I don't know if his name should be Born to Kill. The other guy should have been uh, Born to Kill himself because he literally OTK'd and actually uh, wrecked himself by attacking into with Fairy Box over here by calling it right again five times in a row. I'll mouse over the cards really quick, but I'll include the YDK file in case any of you guys just want to go and click the one click download link for it. But I thought that was absolutely hilarious. And uh, again, that's a very, very rare thing to get five in a row calling all of them right. That That's straight up next level Yugi Moto. That's straight up hacks. That is so incredibly rare, guys. I, I don't think some of you guys understand how rare that actually is. But like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like on it. If you're new here and want to see more stupid Yu-Gi-Oh! videos like this one, and you're new here, make sure you guys subscribe. Turn on that bell to see more of it. And if you guys got any more insanely lucky Yu-Gi-Oh! plays, I don't know if you can beat this one. Again, this is a 3% chance. Feel free to send it into Asianized Replays at gmail.com or send in any other crazy stuff. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. And I'm out. Peace.